The city of Dallas will get a new $5 billion pediatric hospital after Children's Health and UT Southwestern Medical Center announced this week that they're replacing the current Children's Medical Center Dallas. Marin Wolf covers health care for the Dallas Morning News, and she joins us now with more on this one. Marin, thanks for joining us. Good to see you. Thank you for having me. Okay, first question here, probably the obvious question. Why is Children's Health replacing its big flagship hospital? It's the end of an era. Yeah, so the Children's Medical Center Dallas opened in the late 1960s and um, hospitals have lifespans and uh, CMC Dallas is kind of closing in on that. Um, they really just need more space for the growing population, um, more space for newer technology, um, and there are going to be a lot of advances that they have to predict well ahead of what we're going to be seeing in the next 40, 50, 60 years. A uh, $5 billion pediatric hospital, it sounds uh, incredible. What do we know about this new campus so far, Marin? So it's going to take around six to seven years for uh, construction to happen for this new campus. Um, but so far, what we know is that it is going to be a lot bigger than the current campus. Um, it's going to be larger than the size of AT&T Stadium. The hospital itself is going to be taller than the Statue of Liberty. Um, and it's going to have a lot more bed space, around 150 extra beds, more emergency department capacity, um, and a connecting bridge between the new campus and Clements University. University Hospital, um, which is UT Southwestern's hospital. Okay, so, so what does a new children's hospital in Dallas mean for uh, really the whole North Texas community, Maureen? So it's estimated that uh, the pediatric population in North Texas or in Dallas is supposed to double um, by 2050. And with that, that means that there needs to be extra space for those patients to be cared for. Um, in the 2022 Community Health Needs Assessment that Dallas County does, it said that North Texas is designated as a pediatric professional um, shortage region. So this will be an opportunity for more recruitment of more healthcare providers. Um, and more space for people who need that kind of care. Okay, a big deal for all of North Texas. Marin Wolf uh, with the Dallas Morning News. Marin, thank you for joining us. We appreciate you. Yeah, thanks. Thank you. And you can read more of Marin's work right now. Just head to DallasNews.com.